we're currently standing in uh, the Third Line Gallery, Nalsakal Avenue, where I will be giving you a tour of our current exhibition by artist um, Sofia Almeria. Um, Everything Must Go, the title of the exhibition, is actually Sofia's um, first solo exhibition at the Third Line and in the UAE. Um, Everything Must Go is also um, an expansion of a show titled Black Friday, which was shown at the Whitney Museum of American Art in New York uh, in the summer of 2016. The exhibition is divided into three sets of works. Um, the first one is a video titled Black Friday, which looks at the mall culture in the 21st century. The other two sets of works are actually an installation called The Litany and a new series of prints which have never been shown before. Sophia has actually looked at what we call um, the Gruen transfer, which is um, a theory um, named after Victor Gruen, who was the very first architect to design a mall. The design of the mall was made to spatially and temporally make you lose all sorts of all, all bearings, and so, so as to invite people to consume while not being aware of it. Um, and so in that, Sophia wanted to really capture the chaos that comes with it and how integrated it is um, in people's daily lives. Now, in Black Friday, she's filmed two malls in Doha, um, where she is from. And um, these two malls actually are very important because their designs, their architecture, their inspirations have nothing to do with the Gulf region. They're actually inspired by Italian architecture. And so she really wanted to show this loss of culture, territory, and you know, spatial recognition that comes with the mall. So as you go, you're everywhere and yet you're nowhere. And wherever you are in the world, people are intended to have the same reaction to the mall. We have food courts, you stop, you kind of refuel, and then you spend six, eight, ten hours. And so she really wanted to capture the chaos and she created a film that's very doomsday-like, almost apocalyptic, to really come, uh, I mean, have us come face to face with that. So the litany is actually a series of, uh, it's an installation um, comprised of um, 113 videos shown in a loop, about a minute on average, on 113 mobile devices, all recycled, um, which we found around town. You know, some are really old, some are newer, and uh, the information on these videos is actually a very, very dense amount of information taken from the internet. What Sophia intended was to create a correlation between the global space that is the mall and the global space that is the internet. The installation with the devices is shown as a looted supermarket. So you'll see uh, a number of uh, shopping carts that have been you know, crashed into one another and each contain uh, a fair amount of uh, crisps you know, uh, packs and, you know, crisps and packs and um, of products found in the Gulf region. And so it creates this, uh, you know, fun yet scary approach to this culture, the consumerist one. And all around the space now, in contrast to the installation, which is extremely chaotic and very um, messy, so to speak, is actually a linear layout of 99 uh, prints. Um, now, these are digital collages. Um, in the background, stills um, from taken from the litany. Um, Sophia has chosen a number of stills she, you know, she really liked from the 113 videos, and she's collaged on top a word. The words have been very carefully selected to kind of come up with absurd phrases. I recognize this. I, I can relate to this, and so create this kind of comfort and discomfort that comes with relating to the work here. Um, as you walk through, you'll see that the show. Um, it's really quite different. It's also much bigger than the one shown at the Whitney. And yeah, so this, this concludes my tour. Um, I hope you come and see it. Thank you so much for listening.